Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what's the most important, bottom line, critical thing happening on this planet. Today on This Is Important? People don't realize how sexy those shoes can be. Fuck, you don't like Oingo Boingo? Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll, look, I'll look at this guy's dick. Yeah. Buckle up. And we're Ow! I feel good. Bad baby. Friendship, I do feel friendship. good. Uh, oh my God. Can you guys tell I'm wearing eyeliner? Popo uh, Now that you mention it. Can you? A little bit. Yeah. Can you, you look tell? like a. Yeah, actually, very much so. You look like like a girl at a wedding who like cried and is now just hammered on the dance floor. Yeah. And, yeah, who's just over just by the cocktail shrimp, just slamming some. Slurping down some shrimp. Yeah, that's what you look like. Hard target, baby. You look good. Going for her third third <laughs> slice of uh, cake. I guess easy target. I say hard target. I, it's, I, for on work right now, it's the last week <laughs> shooting the outlaws, and uh, okay, I'm, I go undercover to rob a bank. Spoiler, mm-hmm. and yeah. um, kind of not really. Enticing. And it'll be in the trailer. And okay. uh. So I'm like, I have eyeliner and shit on for it. It's so fucking hard to get eyeliner off, dude. What do you mean you have eyeliner for it? Like, is it yeah. a specific disguise? It is a specific disguise. Uh, I don't know if so I want to spoil that. Is that a spoiler? That. Yeah, yeah okay. don't spoil that. I know what it is, though. Yeah, it's a good, it's a good disguise. Uh, mm-hmm. Donke. But uh, <laughs> it's a good disguise. <laughs> is that a line from the, the, Don- the Shrek movie? I don't know. Uh-uh. I don't be. know. There's no way to Why did you say donkey? You just nah, did it because you're, you're Adam matter. Devine. And you'll sometimes you'll say stuff. <laughs> and I sometimes say words, and maybe it has something to do with what I'm dressed as. Maybe it- he just says stuff, man. Right. Hey, and that's why I'm here. No, but so they had uh, they eyelinered me up, and they it's impossible to get off. And then I look insane for for the rest of the night. Like I like a Tebo. You don't you you, you, f- you you say insane, but you look beautiful. But go ahead. Go go ahead. Thank you, Blake. Thank you for saying that. You look hoish. <laughs> yeah, your eyes are popping. You look ho. I know. Yeah, it looks I looks uh like I got a bad case of the smoky eye. Remember right. how the smoky eye was like a thing for a yes. minute, girls would get that, but then you could fuck it up and it just kind of look like you've been crying, and that's what right. it looked like. Yeah. Uh, Super hot. Avril Lam- a- Avril Levine. I'm ca- I, to, to be honest, I'm captivated though. I'll just yeah. say that. And put that yeah. out there. Thank you. Thank you. I'm throwing out some sultry vibes. Thank Absolutely. you. Absolutely. Uh, my buddy Atiba and Blake's uh, very good, no, very he, good friend. Ex friend. I'm pissed at him. On and I off think again. They fuck. Yeah, I think they fuck. Just say our friend Atiba. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. Blake and him. Uh, they, they they're closer than we are. They're very close. Me and Atiba are close. We're we're homies. He came to the bachelor mm-hmm. party. Close sure. homie. Blake and Atiba okay. FaceTime. Every day, wow. sixty nine, dudes. <laughs> hey, man, what can you say? Mm-hmm. Hey, you you said it with the soundboard, but <laughs> hey, you know he has a twin, but I like to consider myself the uh, a, a the triplet. third. Yeah, yeah the, I'm a triplet. Right. Mm-hmm. And so, what about him? The third leg. He's yeah, what about town. him? He's, He's in town. <laughs> He's gonna shoot the posters for the movie. Yes, uh, Atiba, nice. Atiba Jefferson, famous skateboard photographer, uh, famous shot uh, the, basketball photographer. He's just oh, a famous yeah. photographer all, all around. But he yeah, he's great. Shot the poster for Game Over Man, and yes, we did. love him so much that I, I took him for Outlaws. But then no one told me he's coming into town to, today. Right. And no mm. one told me that he's shooting the poster tomorrow. I had no idea. And you're dressed like that? Oh, my God. We have to make you over. Yeah, wait. So you had to put eyeliner on the night before just to be ready for the photos? What now? I, just, I have to do it again tomorrow and then scrub all this makeup off my face because I'm I'm caked in makeup. <laughs> right. And so uh, I'm, I, I'm, I'm afraid I'm going to look like a smoky-eyed asshole in these posters. <laughs> I'm a man. They can you fix might... a lot with. Uh, <laughs> yeah. They can fix be... a lot via the internet, right? For the Photoshop. Yeah. I mean, dude, I saw, and this is not a shots fired because I love this man. Mm-hmm. But I saw a print ad in mm-hmm. a magazine the other day. Mm-hmm. Like, do you yeah, love him? You get magazines. Yeah, Samuel, absolutely. Us, Samuel we... L. Jackson in a <laughs> Capital One. Is that one. a new one? Is that a new one? <laughs> yeah, he got another one. Yeah, I get him every day, once God a week, God us damn. weekly. Go. Samuel L. Jackson, mm-hmm. Capital One ad. Have you mm-hmm. seen this going around? He is uh, fully airbrushed say, in a way go? that's crazy. Yeah, is this a Hertz? Let's go! I, I feel like I said Capital One. <laughs> Capital One, which is a uh, credit like card. Like a credit card, right? Or is that a bank? You know what? Hey, you know what? Let's move on. 
no, no, we're, absolutely we're Capital not. One. Capital One. What do you have in your wallet? You guys watch sports, <laughs> right? It's the only commercial they play. Absolutely. It's a credit card. It's a credit card. It's a credit card. Is now it's Capital One. Let's dive. Let's dive deep into Capital One. Let's dive deep into Capital One, please. Is that a Visa? Is that a Mastercard? Or they're doing their own thing? Capital One is its own. Storm I, the Capital, baby. <laughs> I believe it's a Visa, uh, but Capital One. So it's like a bank. Capital it's One. It's a bank. Oh, okay. All right. Well, all right. Now yeah, we know. That's fucking um, cool. So, but yeah, no, he's getting older. I feel like older actors, when they, they want that that brush look. Admittedly, I've been airbrushed before where they've like airbrushed all the like forehead wrinkles out of my, my power lines, as I call them, mm, right. uh, okay. off my head. Mm -hmm. And and I've been like, right. Oh. And then I saw the movie poster and I'm like, hey. But like people don't oh, know. Not mad at it. You're you're under 40. People don't know you had those power lines as as far as you know. This guy's got to be 70, right? Yeah, yeah you, but, they you have to have power lines. They gave him skin of like a baby. It's weird. Yeah. I would have, I, if I was that old, I'd have been like, yo, give me like something, please. Like something. Old me up just a little bit. Maybe, maybe a little crow's feet or something. Yeah, he's 72 years old. Yeah. I imagine the old look like wrinkles are going to be in pretty soon because people are going to be so unwrinkled that you're going to want those wisdom lines. Have they so ever been in? In the history never. of humans? No. no but never. you think they're about to be? Yes. <laughs> because Blake, they're come never going to be in. And that's buddy. why you're on Fabulous Furry Freak Brothers, you <laughs> wild dog. Because you say crazy things like that, donkey. Absolutely, baby. I like Blake and I are, are up in the merch game. Where's your fun merch, Durs? I'm Blake? rocking Astro Glide, uh, a proud sponsor brothers. of the podcast. Uh, can we talk about how our, our wives, because we all have wives now. I'm part of the club, boys. Lucky. Um, I just saw your wife. She came over for a visit. It was awesome. What the okay, fuck, that's fucking. Hang on. No. What the fuck did you say to me? Not you cool. Me, so we, we have wives now. What did <laughs> you think? You, you know where she is at all. I know. I know. That. No, I know. I, talked to her, I just talked to her a minute ago, and also I track her via my phone in the right. chip. Uh, <laughs> that I've implanted in her. Uh, but. Low jack your wife <laughs> in, her, in her butt. We have as as we have wives, we have the in her butt uh, via Astro Glide. That's how we got it up there. <laughs> That's how we do it. Mm. You use the glide, not the force. As I have a T-shirt that says, uh, "What do your wives think of all?" Because uh, Chloe's, you know, she's like, "Oh wow, another sponsor that is about sex." Mm -hmm. We got Trojan. Trojan's a proud sponsor. We got yeah. Astro Glide. What else can we get? Right, we're starting to run out of like sex sponsors, sexy, I... sexy sponsors. Well, let's. But hey, <laughs> you know, uh, Tanga Eggs, come at us. Yes. Yeah, we're not getting any. Like, I hey, Astro Glide. Excited to get. Uh, I'm excited to use the yeah. product more. It's been a while since I've glided. Right. Yeah. Uh, you know, real. it's been a long while since I've glided. Yeah, you're uh, kind of a dry guy, or what? No, I feel like I, I don't need that much. Uh, I don't need that extra amount of lubrication. Sure, sure, sure. Because and when I <laughs> Blake Blake's talking about solo. Oh, you're a you're a self lubricator. No, my dick sweats. <laughs> you guys. Well, sure. Sweats? Goodbye. When it's working out, huh? Doesn't secrete. Uh, what is? Yeah, what? He's got a sweaty dick. <laughs> well, uh, wait, what? you were saying wait, what? No, it's no, not good. I feel like we need a Tanga egg, dude. That's the thing. Tanga, yeah. get at us. Do you guys out there know about Tanga eggs? They sent some to us, like season three or four workaholics. It's just, it was like a crate of eggs. And we were like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. We briefly mentioned it, but we didn't give it the spotlight we need to. Because Tanga, the eggs Tanga you're changers. getting your flowers. Basically, it's like a, <laughs> what is it? Like a silicone egg. And yeah. then you like pour yeah. the sauce in it, and then you just the sauce. You just blaze it. Basically, Astro Glide. Yeah, fucking egg. Yeah, <laughs> and but then it it's, is it's like all awesome. ribbed inside, and then there's different <laughs> styles of ribbing, <laughs> and it feels differently. Right. There's uh, like the corkscrew. There's like the zigzag. <laughs> so yeah. So uh, us as fully grown men were fucking silicone eggs, dude. <laughs> but by the way, we we gave it out as uh, party favors to all the to the writing staff of work right. right. and uh, all, all all the men didn't uh, allegedly didn't get a lot of female takers, right. and uh, you know the, a lot of them came back and were like, uh, "Yo, where'd you, I left, where'd my you <laughs> yeah, I left my wife? Yeah, I left my wife. Changed my life. Uh, I bought a tanga chicken." And uh, I got my own tanga <laughs> eggs growing in the backyard. <laughs> I thought you were saying like a tanga chicken to bang, like a tanga Ch goat, chicken a banger? tanga sheep. 
chicken banger. Sorry. <laughs> Man, I got your fucking number again. <laughs> Something that Pierce says as like a uh, Pierce Brosnan says as like a slam mm -hmm. is a sheep shagger. Yeah, you were saying that's like his yeah. Ireland slam. Yeah, what a great, <laughs> what an I, epic. That must be like a yeah. burnt, like a serious problem in Ireland or something. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just like, if you're out there in the sticks, you're cold. You want to heat things up a little bit. Yeah, it's like a, <laughs> yeah, I yeah. I guess so. I don't know. I, don't I guess know. I guess I've never called. I you know I grew up in the Midwest in Iowa and Nebraska, and yeah. I've never called anyone like a pig fucker. Yeah, I think <laughs> you but I should start. It's got to date back to when like these sheep herders. Do and I make stuff, you horny? Buddy? They were out on their own for like weeks, just herding those sheep. And around. now they got the internet. You know, they, they're, 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 yeah, they're I'm defending them. Yeah, they were. And out also, people sticks. don't realize how sexy those sheep can be. Like. Do we want to walk down that road? <laughs> well, here's what's Funky. fucked up. Loving. Definitely not sexy, but like, I guess it probably feels okay. I mean, okay. I mean, if we're getting really gruesome about it, I, I think I may have heard that they have a wait, similar. Wait, what? <laughs> I think they have like a similar. Who told you this? <laughs> yeah, where are you going wait, with this? Wait, wait, wait. Encyclopedia, wait. but Britannica. Wait, 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 wait. Before, yeah, I like, I like how he starts with. Before it, we get too gruesome with it, I might have heard. And guys, right, this on. is our holiday episode. Happy holidays to Happy you. Happy holidays. And by the to way, you. Why, why is it gruesome that it feels similar? I thought you were going to be like, not to get too gruesome, but it's got like retractable. Well, no, like, he was about to get gruesome. Claws. I'm sorry, I ruined it by kind of walking back with his setup. But go, go ahead, Blake. Where? Why? Wild who, first of all, who told you? You've heard. I I don't know, dude. Was, oh, okay. All <laughs> there's right. There's no right. way. There's no way. I there's just no way. just say the thing that you'd never heard for fun. Then okay. I was. Then. I think <laughs> I heard it was the most similar to the human female anatomy. <laughs> By the way, the who is the dude here. who's out there going like, "Well, cow is good. Definitely yeah. not the most dude, similar." Sick fuckers, man. <laughs> They're out but, there. But at that They're time, at that point, you're doing it for science, and it's almost not that sick. It's just an experiment. <laughs> mm. Experiment rhino? It's science. <laughs> How's that rhino? rhino. That, you know that rhino coochie is on point. Experiment <laughs> rhino. That's a, Yeah, that is true. That's why they're going extinct. They're going extinct. They're going missing, bro. Why is spearmint rhino... Why, why is it called <laughs> spearmint? Spearmint rhino... Is, is that like a national club? chain Bang? of strip clubs? It, I know it's a chain of strip clubs in California. Yes. But is that... Yeah, it's got to be national. Yeah. yeah. And why yeah, sure. is it called that? Yeah, do we know? That's I think it's question. just one of it's like a band name. It's just fucking sick, dude. Spirit there has to Rhino. be some story behind that. There has to be. There has it has to be some spearmint. Wait a, a second. Is this yes from our manager in the <laughs> sidebar here? Like hella quick about the strip club. Is it being national? <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Bro, uh, I've looked. We get chill. it. We get it's it. It's science. <laughs> Wait, uh, no, I say. There's actually one in uh, Cozumel. It's international. Oh, and then he wrote, "It's it's international." Uh -huh. Oh, bro. Okay. Uh, okay. Are you talking about the, cl the clientele? Okay. The locations. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. What is that? I that Dubai. Like the, Dubai. The strip club game like to have to be under the spearmint rhino umbrella. Because what else is there? There's deja vu. I know is like a umbrella. Is that, is that a that national just mafia chain? Stuff? Should we ask our manager? Is that a national <laughs> yeah. chain? Hey, Isaac. <laughs> Is Deja Vu right. national or is that just California? Um, yeah, I mean, I'm watching Sopranos and I'm kind of like, so is every bada strip club bada guy bada working there like a part time murderer or are they just a guy who's like, yeah, this is so. just what I got into? I, don't I think, think they're so. All murderers, but they've all uh, they've all been around. They've all like buried a body. Yeah, right. They had to. But they they disposed of some. They stuff. yeah. They're they're not maybe the ones pulling the trigger or or slicing through the flesh with the blade. Yeah. Right, but right, right, they're right. if they're not burying the body, they're mm -hmm. DJing the event. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're there. Right. They're just being <laughs> they're like, like, do we want to talk about who was DJing the strip club near the workaholics office way back in the waybacks? Yeah, I, I don't even remember. Who we I didn't do. mention that at uh what dames and dames games, and games in Van Nuys games. shout out it Which was is a tough it's a tough first of all there's a bunch of giant screen TVs playing yes. sports and then there's a, it's like a bikini bar so there's girls dancing like topless or maybe just in bikinis 
But guys are not looking at them. They're just watching the sports. It is the stra- <laughs> It is the strangest idea for a strip club, but it is also really the coolest place to watch a football game. And who was DJing? None, None other than, other than <laughs> Tech, Tech Money, money from oh, the real world. I forgot yeah. about that. Hawaii? Completely. Real world Hawaii? <laughs> yes. He right? was getting a check, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was the man. <laughs> Shout out to Tech, Tech Money. money. He's the I, real skinny guy that was in How High, right? Was he in the movie How High? Did he get a part in How High? Most <laughs> likely. He did. I feel like that might have been hits from the streets, which I'd love to give his flowers Dang. right now. Are we now. talking? Oh. I dude. think I do. I think I did have them confused. Yeah, hits from the streets. What's his What's his name? His name is something funny, like Al. It's Al Shear, but it's not funny. Yeah. It's just, it's just Al. <laughs> it's just Al Shear. Al, okay. If you don't know who Al Shearer is or yes. what Hits from the Streets is, okay, yes. In the early aughts, please break them off. There was a show on BET that played Happy music holiday. videos and then just had this dude who's hilarious, Al, who pa- everyone just calls Hits, who mm-hmm. would walk around, I believe, HBCUs and like interview college kids about like whatever. And it hey, was Durs, hilarious. What are HBCUs? <laughs> Cracker. Yeah. Historically black. Colleges and universities. Yes, okay. yes, yes. And <laughs> and now I know. And he was very knows, funny, and, and he would interview knows. people, and it was just like the best show ever. Yes. Uh, and he's a homie because he's boys with Walt Newman, who uh, put Got us on at Comedy Central. And in um, in How High, I believe he was the character I Need Money, and it, when he smiled, his teeth said uh, yeah. I Need Money, like spelled out in his grill. And that was it, Al, or that was Tech? I think that was Al. I think it was Al. Do you think, think Al and Tech have ever kicked it? They have to have, right? Hope so. They were both just rock stars, legends, of the MTV. legends yeah. of their time. BET was so hard for so long. It was so sick. Right. One hundred and six in Park had a nice run. Yes, Lamorne was on that. Lamorne Morris, the home right. from Oak. He was uh, a host on it. Really? Yeah. He said he after was like, uh, dude who had the the predator hair. What's his name? Uh, um. Um. <laughs> what is his name? Yeah. He cut it all is it off. Free? Is it free? No, free was the. Female co-host, but uh, what was his name? I can't remember. Damn, he was sick. But then Correct. it was, I think it was Lamorne, and Lamorne said he was like hosting that shit while he was straight up like sleeping in his car. Wow. Like he was be, he was like sleeping wow. in his it car like and they then going. Paid him a little more. So I don't get, think they were cutting a huge checks or something. Right. Uh, I remember <laughs> BET Adam's giving it <laughs> housing advice. Yeah. Well, maybe get an apartment or something. Well, I know. Anyway. I feel like I feel like if you're on TV, you should make enough money to get yourself a sensible apartment. Like hey. to me, I'm like, Come I agree. On, BET, agree. 106 of Park is your mm-hmm. flagship show. Hook them up. The best thing about BET though was BET Uncut. If anybody knows, dude, anything. that's what I was about to say. <laughs> yes. They, I remember as a kid, like watching it because they would get like uh, over hell date. Do Go you ahead. remember this song? <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, uh, mm, let me see what you yeah. smell like. Yeah. I want to kick it tonight. Smells like. Let me see so what you smell like. like. Was I like your guys' version. <laughs> At midnight. And then, and then it says him like. Like yeah, just girls like, just like flapping yeah, her remember, butt cheeks, and then and then him like creeping past. No, like, the way the video starts is him getting out of the limo, and, and then he like is like standing creep. there, and then all these girls pass him. And he's like, first you gotta let me see what it smells like, and they like run their finger past his nose, and he's like, okay, you could come in, dude. You oh, watch wow. this. I remember watching this. At, like, I feel like I was a kid. I was like fourteen or fifteen, and just being right. like. What the fuck? I've got it's the what kind of world is this? So what like it these was girls all finger banging themselves <laughs> in the uh, Give me a hell oh, yeah. I like that you don't have the balance. You see that, but then you're like, what are HBCUs? <laughs> I feel good. You, you got one side so, of a coin. No, what it was is after midnight, BET went into BET Uncut and it would play like the gnarliest nice. music videos. So it'd be uh-huh. like, but it was really only like a rotating like 10 it was like nelly's tip drill it was what that thing smelled like it was like this guy named joker the bell bales bond man who was a rapper from alaska okay yeah. okay <laughs> and then do you know and then there was some more sh- but no they're points. all like they're it. all hammers they're points. all just Can I get some points? bangers dude Jers- yeah, sorry Jers- my points bad for that you know do you know do you know yes points oh, yeah but so it would come on so if you were if you were a, a kid, you would set your alarm just to wake up at that time and just you get would? your uncut on. <laughs> if you were, if you were a kid, you would. Would so you? Did you? 
Did you do Hell that? Hell yeah, dude. Uh-huh. Or I'd stay up. Or I it would go from and I'd so go from Conan you O'Brien understand. At this time, over to Uncut. And did you when you got up at that time, did you talk to your friend that knew uh what <laughs> the pussy. what the sheep pussy felt like? I'm a man. <laughs> Same guy. That was just his routine, man. Yeah, same guy. When did he give you that idea to wake up at 4 a.m. to watch? Uh, Hold up. Sexiest video of all time. Sexiest video of all time? Uh, and like, just right off the top of the dome. Let me go, uh, let me go okay. like, uh, okay. let me give my uh, instant uh, reaction. It, donkey. It, Tony, it, Tony Braxton. Okay. Wasn't it like, wait, no, that's when she's like judging Deuce. <laughs> Coming off the elevator, <laughs> dude. I remember that. Those yeah. guys were handsome. Hey, it's all good. Yeah, you're right. That is Blake's favorite. Good Let's call, go. Dude. Right, right off the top of the dome. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> right off the top of the dome, he thinks of a female's well, video uh, judging she would send sexy back. men. Yeah. yeah, but Tony Braxton was so hot. Wait, that, that, wait a second. <laughs> okay. Off the top of the dome. It's that was a good crazy one. Crazy that that's the first one that came to mind. Just off the top you. of the dome, dude. Uh, I what loved is, Tony Braxton so much. I still. Sure. 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 Weird video to have that be the sexiest video of all time. You said sexy, wow. and I envisioned Tony Braxton. <laughs> no, no. Yeah. yeah. I all think right. it was you're making me high. You're making yes, me high. Yes. You are correct. And I then it would be like the video. elevator doors open, and then a fireman would come out, and they'd okay. like and rate him like Blake, a ten. That's what can I, Blake likes. Can I say <laughs> something a, honestly regarding that video? That's I fine. Do, and that's fine that you do, and that's fine. I love that for you. I do remember being. Watching that video and going, you know what? I'm gonna watch this all the way through, cause like, it's not a big deal. I'm not like homophobic. Yeah, yeah. sure. These guys are out here. They're taking their clothes yeah. off. So yeah, they're hot. women take their clothes off in, in in videos all the time. I can sit through this. I can enjoy yeah. it. Yeah, that was progressive of you. Yeah, I didn't. That's, um, um, I wasn't my favorite this. sexiest video. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if a top of the dome that would be the first one. Uh, that just I, I rattle off. Uh, I feel Sorry. like mine. Yeah, I feel like mine was uh, mm-hmm. just uh, Ricky Martin, where he had his shirt off under that waterfall. Right. Or uh, let's go, Vita Loca. <laughs> let's go. Yeah. Or I mean, that LL Cool J, uh, where he's <laughs> also go. under a waterfall with his shirt off, uh, right. just off the top of the dome. If I'm just spitting off the top of the, uh, no, it has I to mean, be like Shakira She Wolf, right? Remember that good. video? That's where pretty she, good. It's, 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 Fuck you. <laughs> Wearing like butt ass naked. She's wearing like flesh colored like oh, long, yeah. and you're or just yeah. like, yeah. Oh, is she? Wait, is she? Yeah. She could be. Wait. God, Shakira. Can I fuck such with you guys here though? Please uh, fuck with us. Hold on, please let me fuck with us. Go for it. Please Aerosmith. <laughs> oh god. Aerosmith. From the seventies. <laughs> wait. wait. Fuck Come on. You. Hang Come on. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Right. okay. Crazy. With his daughter and With Alicia Liv. Silverstone yeah. Yeah, 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 together, yeah, yeah. Yeah. and they go to like a strip yeah. club and like right. dance. Okay. And for for Blake, there's that <laughs> farmer guy who takes his shirt off. Uh, and there's the gas station guy who might as well have been you, who they like, go in, they like st- they like start stealing stuff in the gas station. He's like, yeah, okay, you could take it. Well, I mean, if you're gonna go all the way back to those days, I gotta say, well, remember that's like ninety eight, ninety nine. I know, but the, Tony Braxton's got the same era. Got so much sexier than that. So, because that was right along oh, the you, same are era. Are you talking as, uh, Little Nas X? What are you talking <laughs> no, about? No, no. Like, remember you? Billy Idol, "Rock the Cradle of Love." <laughs> Yo, fucking, first of all, dude, way oh, earlier than the song I just talked wrong. about. Way what? earlier, is it? Yes, yes. but dude. He sh- he she comes well, Aerosmith over because her band tape? in the seventies yeah. doesn't mean that that's when that music video came out. I think it was the same time. No, 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 no. Crazy, crazy. Ninety four. Rock the Cradle, Cradle of Love is eighty eight or eighty nine for oh. Shizzle. And I, just I and re- when I'm serious, I say <laughs> for Shizzle. For Shizzle. He gets serious, and he says old Snoop Dogg uh, toss away lines. Do you know the premise of the Rock the Cradle of Love video? Do you remember? Yeah, like- I do. I do. Cause I, I know tell Adam, because I don't know if he's seen it. I, I know why it got my prick freaking rock hard, dude. It's Your because pecker it hard? was like... <laughs> oh, that's right. My bad. Yeah. <laughs> pecker, hard. pecker hard. Nobody's it was coming like in a, with the time. It was like a babysitter right. came over. Yeah, no. please explain. I don't what? remember this at all. <laughs> no, you fucking... It was a nerdy dude in an apartment, and Nay. the neighbor, a super hot chick, comes over oh, to yeah. play a tape. Dude, he's and got he the had stereo. the glasses on, and then he takes Wait, the glasses I off. I, she <laughs> might take the glasses off. Please, but, yeah. someone pitch me. Someone walk me through this music okay, video. Take okay, take off. Go, Durs. Durs, 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 Durs remembers it. I'm you're a guy. guy. 
Yeah, you, I am. You get home and you see like the hot neighbor across the hall, and you're like okay. you're flustered. Yeah. You're flustered. Hang on, you're a nerd. Second. And can I get my key out of my pocket? Am I barely? Am I, yeah, barely. Uh, you go right. in. Oh, you God. kind of almost say hi, but you don't. Uh, She's already I'm gone. I'm nervous. Oh, yeah. well. Then you're inside. You're like, why am I such a loser? I'm such a All piece of, of sudden, shit. knock, knock at the door. Hang on. Is it Wait the Thai food you ordered? No, it's, it's probably. Not. I'm a fat fuck. It's your hot neighbor. <laughs> Wait she a minute. She wants to ninety. Okay, thank you. Nineteen ninety. Okay. Um, okay, four years. She comes not in. Not that big of a difference. She okay, puts, wait a second. We've been over this. Hang on. Four years at that era. Huge difference. <laughs> huge difference. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. In the stairway. Wait, 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 wait. Let's slow it down. Slow it down. Slow it down. So you I'm, open the door. I, I'm, 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 I, I waft a little Thai food, and I'm like, I'm a, such a fat fucking loser. No. Like, what a fat no. piece of shit. No. Total turd. No. I'm such a I dork. Can't stop you're going, you're going places for reasons I don't know. And you think it's Thai food at the door. I'm such a piece of shit. It's and not. then I open up the door. Hang on. I open They're up the door. not wafting. There's no wafting, though. Yeah, you but don't smell I'm imagining, you know, this is an, it's an audio form. You, right, you, you go know. ahead. Go so ahead. Like, I eat because I'm unhappy. Mm, that Thai, thai food? food. Is that Thai food? And then I open up the door. Click, clack. <laughs> Doors You open. live in a crypt. <laughs> yeah. Doors you open. live in a basement. And then there's a smoking hot babe there. Okay, yeah. go on. And you're like, uh, are you? Do you have the right place? Yeah, <laughs> right? it's like, uh, uh. Um, yeah, I think you're that Your boobs are huge. Down the hall, and you're like, uh, she breezes Skyler right past lives you. down there, or Sean, or whatever hot guy name. She walks right past you to your stereo. You don't know what the fuck. Wait, going she walked on. into my house. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah. pick up yeah. this joint. Com- what are you commanding. gonna do? Fuck it, right? I, yeah. gotta, I gotta quickly pick up all my underwear. I think he might even do that. He might be like, uh, yeah. like yeah. get the place. She together. puts a tape in the tape player, which was mm-hmm. the uh, the highest <laughs> fidelity at the time. Mm-hmm. Hits the play. insertion. The insertion. She, Your boobs are huge. Hits play. Okay. Rock the Cradle Love comes on, yeah, and she just starts dancing and taking her clothes off and jumping yeah. on your bed. Yeah, she and you're just why like, is she doing that? The it's, music is so good. The music, and, and she dude. had to come over to your apartment. Her my tape apartment, a fat I, I think fucking like her- loser piece of shit <laughs> mm-hmm. who just Nerd. wants Thai you're, food. You lose. You're, you're a dork. Yeah, totally. You, gla- you have glasses. So <laughs> I, mean, I have a glasses. Everyone. I can't even see shit. Right. And uh, the only thing <laughs> I can see is my fucking Thai food because I, I all I think about is eating. I'm wearing a right. tie. I have a job that I fucking hate when I hang yeah. myself with it. Well, no, because no. you have a nice apartment. You might like your yeah. job because the oh, guy my seems like he's pretty, doing well. Cool. He's got that's good the hair. the only thing in my life that's going well for me. <laughs> that and my fucking head of hair. Right. <laughs> and all I think about is Fuck Thai it. food. And then... This hot chick comes in. Why is she coming into my room? It, she she liked that I, tape so much. She's no, like, I gotta sh- it, I gotta blow my neighbor. She's a mind. user. She's a no, user. No, I think she like gives some explanation. Like my power went out, or like I I, I ran out of hot water or something. Kill <laughs> 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 yourself. <laughs> yeah, I think she probably does. It turned me on, yeah. bro. And it was a lot of like Thai loose. And you're like, like, Mom, cut off the water. <laughs> yeah. Well, speaking There's of tie loosening, of t- tie loosening, <laughs> I get no loosening, respect. Uh, <laughs> giving them something you could feel in vogue, right? Okay, all remember right. that all right. shit? Those yes. were like they're performing at like a lot of silhouettes, not like a burlesque, but like a very se- it's a sensual video, you know. And the guys yes. just like all the businessmen are like, it's getting hot in here. It's getting hot in here. Well, what about like hot. what about like girls, girls, girls? That's yeah, too much. It's over the top. No, 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 no. Jay Z. No, no, no. He's talking no. about. Uh, no, I'm talking about Motley. Motley Crue, right? right? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Like I think I th- those girls to me. Now we're going in the 80s. Yeah, for sure. No, 80s. No, I... Those girls to me, I think, because I was a kid, those girls didn't even seem like. I mean, probably because I wasn't even thinking sexually at the time. I was like, <laughs> probably because you were eight. Because <laughs> I was eight, not. They thinking were just that cartoons. Way. But they were just cartoons. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I guess you're right. Those, were that hot. wasn't a sexy. I mean, cartoons every are hot. thing. Just I never rabbit. wanted to fuck cartoons. I'm like, I did. Yeah, I did. right. Are I, you kidding yes. me? I never. Uh, Jessica uh, Rabbit. Uh, Jessica what, Rabbit. What about okay, the bunny okay, from take uh, back. Space Jam? Uh, Jasmine Sports? from uh, Aladdin. Yes. Right. Pocahontas. Rick. Those were my those were my one two punches. And then Jessica Rabbit was okay, but you, wait, hey, don't too say much going punch on. about two women. You're like, those are my punches. My one two punches were these two women. Oh, you know what I mean. Uh, you know what I get. <laughs> what I'm trying to say. I, I know you get, you get angry. <laughs> I get you get angry. physical. Fuck you. Um, I never saw Pocahontas. Was that a good movie? Um 
Uh, I don't remember it being good. I remember her. I watched being, it recently. I remember her being like, "Okay, the I song, cool. the song's very heavy." Okay, yeah. Have the you wolf ever cry. Seen the colors of the mountain? I think it's. Have you ever heard the wolf cry? Have, you, yeah. have you ever painted with the colors of the wind? <laughs> yeah, dude. Who wrote that imagine, shit? Imagine Bill if you Collins, could. probably. Yeah, always. <laughs> he was all up in it. Mm -hmm. And then they had the other one that was like, savages, savages, barely even human. <laughs> and that's the one that really uh, stuck with you. problematic. Yeah. Dude, so, there was like four songs in the movie. There weren't that many. So it was, uh, it was weak. you just, you just right. watched this. You're yelling at me. Because what? You have a daughter, so you're always just like throwing on the old school. Uh, like, well, yeah, yeah, is that what you're doing? Movies? <laughs> no, no, dude. This no, is, I mean, like, if that, I'm assuming. No, that this is my. You gotta. I, lean I don't. Into there's it a no bet on cut anymore. So, like, late at night, I just walk down memory <laughs> road, dude. Right. <laughs> I'm just like, what's up with those Disney movies? Were they good? Everybody's asleep. Daddy's gonna go watch his Disney movies. <laughs> Some of them hold up. Uh, Beauty and the Beast holds the fuck up. Yeah, that shit um, is fucking rocks. The. Um, the the Little up. Mermaid music is strong. Yeah, Sebastian carries that movie. If we're being honest, yeah. Hold was up. That, was that a, a true? Was he see like Jamaican? The guy who did Sebastian's like a, voice. I do believe Caribbean? that. Um, yeah, I do. I do think he was actually like a legit. Uh, like okay, Caribbean it wasn't style. just like some guy who's like oh, I could do this. <laughs> Under it was Steve. It was from Steve Ventura. from Full House. He right. was doing both Prince Eric and Sebastian. <laughs> right. Who's Steve don't know from Full House? He was DJ's boyfriend, and he is the voice of Prince Eric in. Um, really? Yeah. Really. Little Mermaid. Remember when they used to cast people that you you're, you're just like, oh, you just yeah. sound right, and you can sing. Yeah, they and just now had a like, great yeah. voice. Who the fuck? Now, ever? It's, yeah. now it's just like, let the rock they, be everything. Now it's just John Cena. <laughs> Adam, the rock go. is everything. <laughs> uh, Freaking see ya. See ya, John Cena. <laughs> How come I'm wearing uh, the Freak Brothers hat now, and I look what? Like I, I look like a fucking bowling ball in this. Thing. You look like the emoji that wears the winter hat. Yeah, yeah. Like Blake that looks shit's cool important. in the in a beanie. Oh, maybe you maybe it looks you just, better. You have it pulled further too far down. Or oh yeah, yeah. now you got CB4. You know, it's that whole the whole ca California. It's straight across. Well, you know? remember when that shit was go like hipsters started to that wear that shit hella, hella, hella high back. Yes. Like that? I feel like Kyle yes. might have rocked it like that a little bit too. If you want to watch, like if you, you watch a show, did, Blake. that person with the hat on will get like killed or something very early on. Yeah. Remember just like the, the Colin the, Farrell started it. Yeah. Just started right? wearing it way back. Yeah. Way We're back. Wearing, uh, like hanging your shit off. Just like way yeah. the fuck back here. Like all the way back. This was during deep V season. This is when I, so, V's yeah. got deep, dude. Remember how deep V's got? I got a quick funny yeah. deep V story where, not deep V, but a hat story. Out with my home. I, I don't even fuck with V's at all. Yeah. Fuck a V. V's are for fuck squares. A it's hard to find a V now. Yeah. Uh, I remember being out at a <laughs> club. Is looking. I was He's out trying. at a club with a homie. And he goes, look at this fucking guy. It's 80 degrees out, and he's wearing a fucking winter hat. And I look at my guy, and I'm like, you're wearing a winter hat. And he goes, oh, <laughs> fuck. You know what I fucking mean, though. I was like, <laughs> I haven't yeah. seen that guy in a few years. But he's a fun guy. But it was <laughs> like, dude, maybe don't you're worry about it. that guy. You're him. Maybe you you're guys should it. kick it. Down, did that guy wear eyeliner? Oh, wait. No. Did I fit in with this club? I don't know. Was, <laughs> Hold on. Fun. Because, fun dude. Although, because I, I don't I wanna... knew some homies back in the day that I would be like, I, with other friends, I'd be like, is he, does he wear eyeliner? Guy liner, mm -hmm. dude. Like, I don't know. Dude, it was guy liner. It was swoop necks. It was. Swoop. Yeah, lots deep, of deep V's. Yeah, because mm -hmm. V's hat was an actual V shape. But remember when the swoop started, where it was just like, remember when you, you were in like elementary school and you play um like yeah, football like and motherfuckers like would hang your, on your yeah. collar. Mm -hmm. And it, remember how fucking swooping that neck would get. Urban mm -hmm. Outfitters, it was crazy. Titties were out. Nipples were I out. I haven't been in male urban nipples. Outfitters, Men's breasts. Uh, outfitters in a <laughs> while. Have you? Uh, have you, Blake? Is is yeah, Blake is still disguised as a high school student. <laughs> of course he has. I'm just gonna go see what they no, have. I in feel here. like Blake oh, purple jeans. Keeps, yeah, all right. Blake keeps a, a finger on the pulse. Uh -huh. he, Blake keeps a, he's he's the go-to <laughs> cool guy of the group. And I'm well, sure he goes into Urban Outfitters. I'm shopping Blake, for the last my time. 
because you were in an Urban Outfitters last week. <laughs> really, for yourself what? or checking on your own merch? What? <laughs> because what? actually, Urban now it's Wait like Urban minute. Home, and they have like cool pillows, oh, okay. and like they have like funny oh. ornaments for your okay. Christmas tree. Happy holidays, everybody! <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> no, but the clothes game is kind of weak now. I feel like mm. they've been poached so hard that like. If you buy something from... I love that I know you so well that I knew you'd recently been. I could smell it on you. Yeah, you could smell it on them. Hey, man. You got to tap in with Urban Outfitters. You got to hey. dance with the girl you brought. You know what I mean? No. No. <laughs> what, 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 you, you bring you, a girl to the dance, and then you never heard you, you marry saying. a much older girl. <laughs> you, dance, you find another girl, you marry her. Um, I don't understand. What does this have to do never with heard that taking saying. a girl to... to the dance yeah. going to urban outfit i wouldn't be where i wouldn't be where i was <laughs> <laughs> yeah without urban outfitter man it really like keep going really, tell what? us more a lot of my wardrobe on work college was just straight up urban outfitter because well, that sure. shit will clear that shit will clear well like, like okay. what for example well, hey, for example, all like, their blanks, all their blank shit. Like they just will have like blank flannels or like blank shirt pocket tees or like it's okay. So if you guys want to know about, do you know who else makes blank flannels? Yeah, like, everyone, blank. <laughs> everyone. And I also am, I'm not going to like just check into the store of that, uh, that I wore the clothing sorry, once on a TV show it's still, and go like, I have to, they you wrote, dance, they raised You gotta me. dance with <laughs> the girl you came with, bro. Hey, Adam, <laughs> is, a, right. is a thing he's saying? Okay. Move, move on. Sal! Let him have yeah, it. Yeah, but at, I don't know if people know, like costume department, like you can't just wear anything on television. That's why sometimes when you watch like reality TV, their, their clothes are blurred because mm -hmm. maybe they, you couldn't clear Nike or Adidas. But Urban Outfitters makes a lot of stuff that is blank. I feel like, like I wore Adidas almost every episode where I was wearing. Because um, Adidas signed off on you, dude, because you're a freaking And you Adidas couldn't get anybody to sign off on you? Because you're a cool dude. It wasn't in my case. You have you such a look. You're such you an icon. think Blake Henderson was wearing Adidas? Stoner extraordinaire. Come on, dude. Yeah. Uh, um, Adam, we've had a holidays. wardrobe change from you. Talk to me because it's a little blown out. Yeah. And now it's a lot of blown out. It's more Freak Brothers merch. By the way, they, more Freak they made merch. so much Freak Brothers merch. Oh, yeah. We, we this is what I was how, talking is about. how is your merch, guys? This is what we were talking about before the podcast started. Uh, when you guys went to the premiere the other day. Myself. Uh, yeah, you and and Pete Davidson. And, and John and, Goodman. I got to meet John. And John. And our boy. As oh, hello. Hi. Good. Good to and see And Andrea hear Savage. Him. Very funny. And Phil Very Lamar. Super funny. So is Phil. But Dude, uh, he's a so, God. who else? So, fabulous furry freak brothers. <laughs> you, I see you guys in your merch. Yes. Uh, you, you look great. Uh, I Dri see dripping? specifically <laughs> Pete in a freak, a corduroy freak brothers hat. Yeah. Yes, that is super dope. Mm -hmm. I got a giant freak. Bro I'm a. We're, we produced the show. Got a giant box of freak brothers shit. Didn't Yezer. get that hat, man. He, I think he got elite level merch. Yes. He got the and I got the B level shit. Mm -hmm. I'm, yeah. I, admittedly, I'm a little buttered by it. He got but as a producer, don't you want Pete Davidson, super famous headliner, to be wearing the best stuff? Well, what was sick? Well, uh, what no, was I do sick, want. I also want me to have the best stuff. Yeah, what but, was sick? But is then he it's not the best anymore. It's got to be. It's. <laughs> Do you know what no, I mean? No, they're selling because if you're if at you're wearing Fred it, Siegel. he's gonna be like, I'm not gonna rock that. Do you guys have like a? He can wear it first. I'll give, him, I'll give him first run. He already wore he, it. He wore it on like he wore it on Jimmy Fallon, and then like Miley Cyrus took it off her his head and put <gasps> it on, and yep. it's it, it's a yeah. whole movement, man. It's oh my god, it's a fucking movement. Huh. Zip uh, it. Okay, so it's it had its run, and I'm happy yeah. for him. Yeah. And now I'd like the hat. That's all I'm saying. It's a cool hat. Mm -hmm. Okay. The Why Brothers. don't you ask? Do you want to? Do you want everyone to turn their shit down and talk to him personally and maybe ask him for the hat to just maybe yeah. send it to you? To Pete? Yeah. Yeah. No, I want everyone to keep to keep your volume up because this isn't for volume. Pete specifically. Volume. Uh, Flow this is flowers. for the other producers and the people that sent the merch. Larry's hook hook a brother up with the corduroy hat. That's mm -hmm. what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Blake, did you get the corduroy hat? Yes, I did not. Oh God! If he got the God, <laughs> I see. I could see him getting the corduroy hat too. Uh -huh. I, I know there's levels of this shit. You think I got he the got trucker it, he cap? They look you? at me and they're like, "He's a tru trucker hat type of guy," which I get. What does that say, Adam? I can't read it. 
Well, now I gotta take it off. It says wake and bake. It's it's Adam it's and I's and characters. Yeah, it's our character Chuck and Charlie. Wake and bake, cannabis and coffee shop. That's the uh, cannabis and coffee shop that Sick. we run. And those are our characters that they're like uh, when they were designing them. It's when we were talking about doing the work all us cartoon mm -hmm. and we were like, I don't know. We don't want it to look exactly like us. And they're yes. like, we won't make it look like you, but it'll be close. And these are the guys that they came up with. Uh, but I'm like, I'm not. I don't know who's Blake. who. I'm the Blake, I can Blake, I could see the guy with like more hair, but then that guy's like the fat guy. And I'm definitely the fat guy of the two of us. <laughs> but then they gave me uh Hair that I've never had in my life and a flavor saver. Yeah, so dude. <laughs> it, they took some liberties. They took some liberties. Yeah. <laughs> this is the way. Well, if you guys could, we actually should post the mock ups hey. of our Freak Brother characters because they were very cool. It was like us freak yeah, they, sized. Uh yeah, they, they freak, freak sized. Freak, 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 freak sized. Freak sized. How about you were on a different frequency? The, okay. You feel oh, me? Fuck. <laughs> Fucking give him yes, points. Yes, points. Oh, you tonight. feel me on that? Yeah, you're on dude, fire, I'm dude. I'm feeling you. Jesus Happy Christ. Happy freaking holidays. I'm giving holidays. you something Happy you can ho feel. Happy ho ho holidays. <laughs> dude. Uh, <laughs> so so this is deep in. Do your children listen to the podcast? Uh, <laughs> Arnie's a little behind. He's a few We're episodes back. back. He's a possibly the dumbest question, yeah. <laughs> and I've had a lot of them, but that one's pretty stupid. I don't give a fuck. No, so ob obviously they don't. No, not uh, some at someday all. they will. No. Uh, no, he'll be like, my, remember my loser no. dad who hung himself? <laughs> what your ass? I, I guess he had like a hundred episodes of talking about titties and jizz. Have you listened? Your boobs so are huge. No. <laughs> that is so true. Yeah. All right, so a, uh, I'm ashamed. So what do you guys do? I, so you talked the last week on the podcast. You were talking about how you watched Gremlins <laughs> with your daughter. Right. They said yeah. we never touched on this. They yeah, yeah. they mentioned the like they, they're like oh, Santa's or Santa's not real. Yes. And you had to have a like a sit down talk with little Marzi. <laughs> no, and be I, like, Yo. no I, it was a silent. It was silence. You just sit in silence and you mm. hope they forget. <laughs> Right. You don't talk oh, about it. I thought you said I had to have a conversation. You said I had to have a conversation. Yeah. Well, uh, he's a sure liar. He told us he heard that sheep pussy was the closest to human. Papa Sal! He could say no, anything. Dude. He could say anything at this point. Nobody knows. Keep it a mystery. I'm the Riddler. Oh, boy. We're back to oh. Edward Nigma. Well, the, hey, we're off Gremlins. Okay. What, you know, wanna... So did you, you, there was no conversation to be had. No. You just no. were quiet? Yeah, th and that's hope she wasn't I'm, listening. I found a good way to parent is if something really awkward comes up, you just sit in silence for. <laughs> oh boy! Yeah, the beginning of that sentence is terrifying. You know, uh -oh. I found a good way to parent, and then just anything after that's crazy. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, Durs, have you had any kind of conversation like that, or they're, they're, your children aren't at that level? As far as yet. Santa Claus? Yeah. Uh, m like a, the in I mean they're. In uh, yeah, dude, come on. So I keep it down. But like hey, the intricacies. Hey, sorry. We don't I was, have to. I was talking this to, about this today with some some parents at soccer, uh, mm -hmm. some stand-up comedians that you might know. This is secret talk, adult secret talk. Um, and I was like, I feel like Santa in 15 years is going to be over. I think right. a lot of parents are going to be like, No, I don't like yeah, having this kind of a relationship with my with my children. Santa where I'm lying to them about this. Santa thing. got me too. No, but I I just think that the the lie, it's gonna get weird, and the, people are gonna worth pass. Lying. Dude, it's not. It's it's not gonna God, get weird. And, and I can't, I can't, talk, can't I keep wait. Talking about they're in the room. Okay, okay. <laughs> I just I yeah, can't just wait lying. to start lying to my kids. I know, but as soon as you, you wow. Don't, and by the way, not to put you in check, you don't know, bitch. Um, yeah, but no, I don't know. It, it is a weird thing know. to like really get into the weeds about it. Where it's like, so if you don't have a chimney, what what happens? And you're like. <laughs> Yeah, oh, he, he's a locksmith. <laughs> he can get in anywhere. And then, dude. Well, it's you, my parents you, just use the blanket statement of magic. I know, but this is yeah. this is but you that's wanted, forty five years ago. For yeah, you. dude, magic still like there weren't cell phones. <laughs> like, dude. I'm just they saying, couldn't, like, they couldn't go on YouTube. Yes, thank you. They can literally go on YouTube and be like, "Does the elf on the shelf move?" Yeah. And then look for video evidence. Right. And then there's some dumbass 
Jake Paul motherfucker. Like, it's not real. <laughs> right. Dude, I mean, <laughs> we grew up getting wooden toys, right, guys? Like, I'm just saying. Like, I did. I just had an aunt that would always give me wooden toys. And I'm like, you're fucking killing me here. We're watching Rock the Cradle of Love. <laughs> <laughs> There's a sophistication level that, like, the, the lying is just, you've got to get in the weeds with it. So I go, hey. Go sit down and watch Kurt Russell in Chronicles of Christmas again and, and stop fucking talking to me. Um, yeah. Smart. But a very and that's a, a great a, and, you, and know, you found you found that to be a good way to parent? I don't know. I haven't seen him in I haven't seen him in days. But there was a, a dad today who was very funny. It was like uh they converted to Judaism because it was just too difficult. Judaism? <laughs> Judaism to like uh Juicyism. I've had a little too much of the juicyism of novel. Yes, yeah, sir. Right. What you drinking Happy there, Jersey? Holidays. Uh, I got a little jack. Happy holidays. A little well not jack, but whiskey ginger ale. I love that. Um yeah. shout out to uh little night night. Q ginger ale. Send me some you, shit. All right. You wanna know what kids I might, went I might get me another can to write this one out. You wanna know what really reawakened the Christmas spirit in children? A fucking elf on a shelf, dude. Oh, they love it. <laughs> I feel dude. like yeah. this is like a ten year ago topic, but like elf in the shelf goes hard yeah. in the fucking paint, Adam, go dude. get that drink. Uh Blake, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. No, dude, like that that is like real <laughs> Yeah, Adam's gonna take a couple minutes because what Blake's talking about is Almost Friendship. irrelevant. Uh, we watched the Elf on the Shelf like Netflix show. Is so, that real? So bad. They made oh, like they made a movie. Terrible. Whoever's got the rights was like, we got to get a fucking movie out there and made it in ten seconds instead of getting a Hemsworth <laughs> is it real? or a Chris to play this dude. It looks like who is it? Is shit. it Steve from Full House doing the voice of the elf? Who they the got fuck some people, get? but it's it just is it's like shitty. It looks like um, Tekken graphics, you know. <laughs> It looks like Virtua Fighter. Sorry, it looks like Virtua Fighter <laughs> graphics, and it's it's booty. So wait, so for every like uh, video of like a Jake Paul motherfucker like telling your children that Santa doesn't exist, there has to be videos of like some dad who got way too into Elf on a Shelf and like made a video of it walking around yes, the house. And dude, shit. there are there's like security yeah. cam footage. You got to like show the- your kids that and really get in the weeds with See? the lion. And then you're just you're deep in it. <laughs> yeah, so and next, yeah, the lie just it it just it's a spiral. It's a downward spiral. I like spiral. to shrug and go, I don't know. Yeah, that is crazy. Know. <laughs> Ask your mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's got a lot Yeah, he's got a lot of reindeer. Yeah, because admittedly it was how did you guys I remember like kind of trying to call my parents out on it yeah. and then they were they were just like they were like, "Yeah, no, he's not." I think it just being like I just wanted them to lie to me again. I'm like, "What?" Right. No. Right. No, that's not, you were supposed to say no. You started just yeah. swinging at the air crying. Yeah. Like, uh, <laughs> why? Kuba Gooding Jr. Is that what it was? I don't know. Uh, yeah. I, I remember one year, Polar Express, we're all familiar. The kid asks for a bell, right? Mm. In Polar Express. It, I, I don't, don't remember. Know. I okay. Never so, saw like, that the, he gets, he goes to the North Pole, meets Santa. First gift of the year. What do you want? He goes, I want a bell off the fucking reindeer. Oh, that is so reindeer. bad. Yeah, and then he, he loses a PS5. It. Yeah, yeah, that's okay, that's fun. not that wasn't available at the yeah, time apparently. Right. Um, yeah. You know, <laughs> but so I go GI Joe. Yeah, said I want a future gaming system or something. I think I'm seven years old, and I go, I'm starting to doubt Wait, it. Polar Express, the book. Yeah. Oh, the book. <laughs> oh, it was a book. Oh my god. Yeah. It's a it's a whatever. I, I don't even know. If I've seen the movie because the book is so fucking tight. The, it's a it's a Caldecott it's a Caldecott <laughs> award winning book. Okay. We, All right. Adam, literally anything you see that's a movie is was not a original. Right. Yeah, it's a book or a comic oh, no book. Shit. Or a co- so no shit. the kid gets a works? fucking bell, right? And I go, you know what I'm going to do this year? Because I'm just, kinda, I'm starting to doubt. I go, I'm going to sleep downstairs on the couch in front of the fireplace, and I'm going to ask for bells. Is this going to get sad? So <laughs> if so if it he's is. giving me a bell, I'm going to hear it. It stirs his childhood. <laughs> it's about it's to sad get sad. As and I woke up. <laughs> Outside in a pile of lumber. <laughs> well, why don't you cry? And about so it? I woke up and there were bells next to me, and my parents oh were my like, "God!" My parents were like, "Oh my God, you got the bells!" I go, "How did how did I not hear them ring?" He's like, "Well, they're magic." And I was like, "Holy shit!" That bought me another year. The a year later, my brother. Oh, dude, your parents are the shit. They yeah, killed that's it. Fucking cool. And the, by the way, yes. they put on all the presents while I'm just fucking oh. loped out right there. And then a year oh, later, when I'm like awesome. still into it, my oldest brother Oli just goes. He's not real. 
<laughs> because like my mom had used the same wrapping paper or something and she was just tired and was and Oli was like no it's over my parents did that too and my my mom was like well santa knows what kind of wrapping paper he wants it all to match and i'm like well, but again know, okay. the lie it it's makes, like how many lies sense. can you tell your kid my mom yeah. killed it with that she said she said she said santa brings the gifts we leave him paper to wrap with at the house and it's You're, like oh, oh yeah this is when you find out how good your parents are at <laughs> yeah. lying Dude, well, you just got to say magic, dude. You just have to say magic over and over again. Uh, yeah, like, obviously, just it's it's magic. I wanted to try to trip my kid until he goes off to college. <laughs> and he's just fucking <laughs> Shut up, bitch! And we, uh, just devastated. That's a movie. That's Swi a movie right switching there. Gears, That's a movie right switching there. Switching gears two movies? You guys... I got a Stop huge. That. I got a huge announcement. Being a kid's movies is okay. a real segue, okay. guys. Okay. Uh, okay. I, I took Arnie to go see the new Ghostbusters Afterlife. Okay. Okay. What do we think? Go off, King. And I, I, I just yet. gotta say, fully cried. <gasps> Wait, oh what? You did? <laughs> This, it, is, oh this is big news. It's, Why didn't we start the podcast? With yeah, this? we could have got fuck. an hour out of this. Yeah. We could have milked this. Almond. I uh, <laughs> yeah, and you know how much water it takes to get an almond. Um, They're canceled. The movie. Why did you and cry? I, I don't want to give spoilers. Don't tell away. me Winston died. If Winston dies, I cry. I'm not gonna give spoilers because it, it is cool. But they, but like the end of the movie, I and by the way, let me just preface. I love Ghostbusters. Okay. If you don't love Ghostbusters, you're not gonna feel this way. It's um, your favorite movie, almost kind of that and Bottle Rocket, right? It's it that and Rushmore. Rushmore are my two mm -hmm. favorite comedies, right? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yep. yeah. So you, you talk about it a when lot. It, it's like the kids <laughs> are moving back to like they like are kicked out of their apartment and like it's Egon's sure. daughter and granddaughter grandkids and they move to mm. Egon's like weird farmhouse out of the middle mm -hmm. of nowhere to like mm. collect a check and it turns out to be like this shitty. And the person who's kind of like in charge of the deed is Janine Melnitz, who was the secretary. So, uh, homegirl so, Annie Potts is wow, back. Look at you, go right? Off. Wow, Annie okay. Potts is back. Yeah. I I probably won't feel the same way because I don't. I wouldn't know all the deep cuts. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Is this and, this is the girl with the glasses? Yeah. Oh, when she takes the glasses off, it's so hot. Yes, and she goes. Are you the woman I spoke to on the phone? Which is a line from the original movie. Um, the and that hair? got you yeah. going? No, no, no. That was just like yeah, hairs on the this, neck. And this I was is like, all right. We're lost. <laughs> all right. I was like, we're, fuck. Hey, dude, we're in the weeds over here. Just lie to your kids about Santa. <laughs> Dude, so, Durs, this movie was You're made get for specifically for you who knows every line, every character. Like, this okay, is for Ghostbusters I want to give it... But Arnie, I'll, let me, get, I'll, I'll, let me I'll clear it up. But then, it so does that, seem like a cool movie. It's great. And then I do think it's good. I think it's genuinely a good movie on its own because oh, Arnie, good. Arnie loved it. He was still thinking about it a few days later. Um, and in the end, there's a whole, like, thing that goes down that I'm just like, holy fucking shit, this is heavy for me. Like, oh, my God. Wow. Um, That's when you started to cry? Yeah, I was just like, this is too real. Like, this is real. This is not the movie's Whoa. real, but, like, what they're doing, what the mess, like... This the, is too real, Pam. The shout-out that the... The shout out that they're Whoa, giving. Why don't you cry about it? It's, it's and I'll definitely say, for Harold Ramis. Exactly. Yes, Harold Ramis is because he's actually passed away. No longer away. with us. Mm -hmm. And yes. the shout out they give and how they do it, it, it like it's a little clunky movie wise. He but says, like, Egon. It's oh, bro. <laughs> Egon. That's from Ghostbusters uh. too. For our listeners, Do. <laughs> that's Egon. A good, that's a great, <laughs> Do Ray Egon is so good. Do Ray. Uh, but I highly recommend it. It's fucking dope. Okay. Um, and what is that called? It's called Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters this ain't Ghostbusters. <laughs> this ain't Ghostbusters. It's called it's This Ain't porno, Ghostbusters. The Google porno it. parody. Yeah, you can, <laughs> you can find it on Pornhub. I got that somewhere real close. <laughs> Do you think well, we talk about porno more than uh, any other? Dude, Adam, we literally we literally did the, the pleasure is ours. We literally did the Trojan pleasure is ours. And after yeah. the first two, <laughs> Trojan... Came to us and said, "You have to stop talking about porno, dude." Yeah, I know. Like, I was go, there. What? Yeah. Don't you know that's yeah. almost where all the sex? We're like, happens? why did you get us? <laughs> so that's that. kind of our whole thing, though. It is crazy how at some point workaholics episodes there was always at least a C story. It was like, and maybe like she was from Pornhub. <laughs> <laughs> maybe we like maybe we remember her from like a Heather Eye Deep Throat video? I don't know. 
<laughs> I know. We're like a, a deep just, cut. Everybody knows what this is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everybody, everybody's on board. We yeah. all know it. It is funny when you see, like, um, there'll be a meme that'll just be, like, a frame of something, and it's like, if you're over 30, you know exactly who this is or whatever, and you're like, yeah, I know. Yeah. 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 You know, or like, age yeah. yourself with a <laughs> with the picture of a right. porno you watch. <laughs> <laughs> right. And you're just like, man, got me through some tough times. Dude, the best. Man. <laughs> Honestly, like, the... What there should be a where are they now porno thing. Should we produce a where are they now porno thing? Durs, it's sad. They're dead. Their disease is bad. It's not no, good. They're fine. They're all doctors. They're doctors and lawyers. No, no. Okay. <laughs> all right. Some of them. Or they've needed doctors Say. and lawyers. <laughs> Durs, they have stuff on Netflix that is called like laughter life after porn, and they're all very like uh, not yeah. hyped. Yeah, it's usually not <laughs> what? the best. How are they scenario? not hyped? They have <laughs> Hours of footage out there of them at their best. <laughs> their bodies look fun. Yeah. Having fun. Bodies look banging, having fun, having a blast, wet and wild, crazy kids. Have you guys yeah! ever seen a porno star out in the wild? Because I remember I had at a Barnes and Noble, I did like a fucking quadruple take. And she looked at me and was like, Yeah. Who was it? Uh, Are you ready? I saw... Should I, can I blast this? I don't think it's a big deal. But it's, a, it's an, and it's a deep cut. Okey you're going to be like, Whoa! Because it wasn't going to expose you more than her. No, no, no. Because she was a star. She was a star. I think she might have been like star of the year, or whatever the fuck they do. Um, and she was just in a hoodie. Do you remember Ashley Blue? <laughs> kind of. Yeah. It's a bagel. Adam has to pretend he doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, I kind of oh, do. Yeah. I don't really. Oh, I love it. Or, no, I blue. Think I do. Yeah, blue, blue, blue. Um, <laughs> she was at a Barnes and Noble. And I was next to her, and I look, and I go, oh, shit, what's up? Okay, cool. She was signing books or, like, buying a book? Yeah, she was at a huge book si signing. <laughs> uh, no, she was, like, looking at like, right or something. Yeah, I remember this girl. <laughs> Don't say it with did the fucking, re that register. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, didn't she, like, she, like, uh, hardcore, came hardcore. out and Happy say, holidays, everybody. <laughs> say that she, like, hated porno afterwards or something, right? Sure. I think, I, I think this is why we need to. the show. This is why we need the yeah. show. This is why. Uh, I ran into Peter North at a 24 hour fitness once, this and is, I was like, "We've gotten into this." I was yeah. like, "How did I fucking know this guy?" Yeah. Hey, will you <laughs> spot me, bro? I don't, think, I don't no. think I've ever ran into a porn star in the wild. Is he the best uh, porn star of all time? Where you you're just no. like male porn Evan star? Evan Stone. Evan Stone. Evan Stone's the funniest. I don't know if I like watching him bang. <laughs> Personally. <laughs> I don't know if like, I like watching them. Yeah, but Say what's his name had like an inoffensiveness where you're like P Peter North had like a yeah sure yeah I'll I'll look I'll look at this guy's dick yeah what was uh Bo Boogie Nights about who was it about John Based Holmes on? but uh, have you ever John seen John Holmes. Holmes you don't want to watch that guy fuck yeah I've never have I honestly I've never seen a true John Holmes porno oh you're missing out oh <laughs> well <laughs> Boogie yeah. Nights I love Boogie Nights I love. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, happy, happy holidays. holidays. <laughs> happy holidays. Just Dude, the season. I, just, I wanted to just kind of say, hey, <laughs> hey, we talk about porno. It all kind of loops back to porno. We don't have to bookend it with 20 minutes on, <laughs> on porno. Did we start, start with porno? While. What did we start with porno? <laughs> what did we cover sure. today? We, uh, we start, we kids we all revealing do. Santa. <laughs> yeah. We Parenting do. advice. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, happy holidays, guys! <laughs> hey, from ours to yours. Are you? Do you guys have big holiday plans? What's the deal? Uh, no, uh -oh. man, we're locked oh, down here. We're just, just we're doing it the home home I'm house. Just gonna, I'll just like do that. that Nightmare Before Christmas marathon. Just keep it twenty four oh, hours. Just on one. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's yeah, my favorite. Just one over and over. And is, it, they do that? is that your favorite? Oh, that is by far my favorite Christmas movie. I love Nightmare Before Christmas. No, no, I think that movie's kind of boring, dude. Wait a second. Is Die Hard a Christmas movie? <laughs> I think that movie's a little boring. What? Yeah, I'm with you. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I, just, see, I, I never that... like loved it. I always kind of I knew that it was cool to like, so it's I was not always cool like, to oh, like. Yeah, it's it's okay. just fucking no. It's a great... super cool to like. Yeah, I don't like Why? Jack Skellington to be honest. I think it's what? like it's hip, Danny Elfman. It's a hip, hip thing to like. That's his voice. No, it's not. It, I think it's counterculture. Sorry, of Jack oh, Skellington so that's is Danny it. Elfman's yes, voice. Yes. Yes, exactly. Danny Elfman cool. does all the music. I think that's why I don't like it, because I could tell. They Fuck, didn't... you don't like Oingo Boingo? Uh, 
I don't, I just remember not loving it, so I don't remember anything. Are you from ready the movie. for the sex girls? Uh, Is that the I one? just feel like I do feel like I they're... just watched the Grinch, uh, the Grinch who stole Christmas with Jim Carrey. Yeah, not good. My fucking god, it rules! It's just so much Is fucking it? fun. Yeah, uh, I just okay. I remember the cartoon where it was like your mean one. Mr. Grinch. Grinch. Go ahead, keep going. Don't stop. Who uh, was that? Was that James Earl Jones or who was singing that? No, wasn't that? What's his name from uh, Clue and Home Alone 2? And Sam Curry? Or maybe I'm just thinking John of Home Alone 2 when they do like a fade from him to your the mean one. Tim Curry. Mr. Tim Curry. Grinch. Grinch. Oh, Tim Curry. Yeah, yeah. No, they he do has like, like a dissolve to his face. In... It's like a dude with a real true deep ass voice. That's the three I think we need to make. Tim Curry? Okay. I was just thinking about that uh, Christmas movie that we we worked on for a while that we were trying to get going, and mm -hmm. uh, still a great idea for a movie. Yeah, it still is. a great idea. We should yeah. we should do that next Christmas. You guys will be seeing that, or wait, five Christmases from now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Let's It'll give us some back. runway. We'll circle back to that one. Uh, but, there's yeah. been some real. I don't want to do shots fired. I just watched the new Home Alone movie. Uh -oh. Okay, we doing shots fired, flowers. Okay, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Give us yeah, yeah. flowers. Does anyone Let's want shots? <laughs> does anybody have some epic slams? I'll, it sounds like Durs does. Yeah, it seems like Durs has an epic slam. A lot of fun people involved in that, you know. <laughs> in what? In what? Now? In the new Home Alone, which I believe is called Home Sweet Home Alone. I don't. I don't even know about this. It's, it's, Perfect. It's on the your 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 TV. Um, no. I, I'm not sure. Right. Where, I'm not sure. Where Finish him. But it, it is kind of crazy how, like, you can tell that they, like, kind of rushed it. Or, I don't know. It's just, like, it makes you w go back and watch Home Alone and go, like, oh, wow. Like, this is really good. And obviously, like, um, to, to go up against something like that is very tough. Like, yeah. well, that's a tall order. That's hard. When yes. is the last time you watched Home Alone? Every year. Because there is a lot of shit yeah, that I nowadays it. doesn't work out. It's, like... A lot of airline shit that is not the same nowadays, and then phone calls, which are not the same nowadays. Oh yeah, now okay. it's like yeah. really easy. It's you. You just would call right away. Yeah, and like you, but, you're not gonna get through security without your kids because back then it was just like you just walk on the airplane. But that's not the point. Like I know, but it, even there, if there's a just, movie came no, out, no, there's super hinge hey, shit. Hey, you want to talk about Dune? Why didn't they just uh, <laughs> pick up their cell phones in Dune? It's a world with <laughs> itself. It. Laser. No, you dumb. Uh, Dune is on another planet, bro. And this took place in a certain time. So, what are you talking about? I'm just trying to. If you're why don't, why don't you it, apply the thing of like, don't you, know, you realize that this has changed? Like, yeah, but like it was this then. So. What are you yeah, talking about? Yeah, but I'm about? saying, no, we're saying like the, uh, the movie now. No, he's saying it. And now you're saying it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, you stupid. Like, we don't want to fight you. I think what he's trying to say is the movie a nowadays, wall. you couldn't make that movie now because there's to, a lot of things that To be fair, have, done have not seen the new one. I have not seen the new one. Right, but what I'm saying is that I'm not No saying... one has. It's not out yet, is it? Yeah, I Durst just watched saw it. it. You saw the new. Oh, you saw that. That's the whole why thing. I'm I, talking about it. Oh, because I it, you saw it, a trailer. It I makes love you it. appreciate how great the OG was because you're like, man. And there yes, weren't cell phones. And by the way, if if there if you can't do it because there's cell phones and da da da, and they have a bunch of things to like fix it and clean it up and like explain that away, uh, don't make the movie. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> what else came out? What Home else? Sweet Home Alone. Oh, it's Disney Plus. Yeah. Okay. And funny, That's right. Every, funny performances. Allie Mackey was in it. She was funny. Hey. Uh, of uh, Workaholics fame. Workaholics fame. Of from fame, the Clippers yes. game. Epi Weeby, Weeby Ballin. Also was in Weeby my first Ballin acting Epi. class in L.A. ever. Uh, oh, which She's I think was that works out 34 years ago. Today. Holy the, shit! <laughs> that seems right. That math checks out. Hold up. Uh, uh, the streaming wars, man, they're heating up. Everybody needs needs that hot, hot content. Yeah, I know. Peacock no parents, rocks. no problem. Yeah. Paramount Plus rocks. Disney they all Plus rocks. Rule, dude. I'm an HBO. They all rule. I'm HBO Hulu Max rocks. till I die. That's HBO my that's, Max. It's the best one. It's the best one. Hulu rocks. Yeah, HBO Max uh, does have really dope stuff. But pick your Netflix. pick your number one. Mm. Hmm. I'm, HB, I'm HBO Max. I am. Well, I, mean, I, I would say probably Netflix. Netflix has a... I, dude, I'm going to open up a can of worms. Uh, fucking Disney Plus is the thing I watch the most because it's dropped Star Wars. It did the Beatles documentary, which I dude, had to tune I, in. I think I've watched three things on Disney Plus. Yeah. Maybe really? two. 
Yeah. Well, at, at late at night, I watch Pocahontas alone. <laughs> I knew you did. <laughs> okay. Hey, and that Let's was another go. episode <laughs> of... Yeah, I guess we might as well. <laughs> this is important. This is important. Is important. Happy holidays, Happy y'all. Happy holidays, y'all. Triple X edition. Yeah. <laughs>